Filming Stranger Things was hard because I would never be able to hear them. He goes, action! And I'm like, I can hear <laughs> now. It. Eleven may be Stranger Things' most mysterious character, but that doesn't mean the young girl who plays the role has to be a stranger to all of us. We already know she's not American, and her family literally moved their whole lives to follow her dreams in Hollywood. But there is so much more to know about Millie Bobby Brown. So today we'll be taking a look at some of the craziest things you never knew about Millie Bobby Brown. Make sure you stay tuned till the end of the video because the last one will blow your mind. But first, a simple reminder on how to enter our brand new giveaway. We will be giving away either an iPhone X Max, the new iPad mini, or a MacBook Pro. It's all your choice. So be sure to leave a like, comment the keyword, subscribe, and turn on notifications to enter the giveaway. It's really that simple. Let's start with a cool update about her accolades. Did you know that Millie Bobby Brown now has 11 acting awards under her belt? Not bad for a 16-year-old, don't you think? For her amazing performance in Stranger Things, MBB has actually received 20 award nominations in acting. She took home trophies for 11 of these, including an MTV Movie and TV Award for Best Actor in a Show and a People's Choice Award for Favorite Female TV Star. Needless to say, Millie has gotten her big break after years and years of auditions, disappointments, and getting cast for small, insignificant roles. Speaking of small, insignificant roles, did you know that Millie Bobby Brown was actually in Modern Family? Yeah, if you watched the episode entitled Closet, you'll love it. You'll find that Millie was the young girl whose bike got stolen by Manny. It was a cool but really small role. Now look where she is. Next is that everyone knows Millie and Drake are friends. But did you know that Millie Bobby Brown also has a close friendship with Aaron Paul? Yeah, he's actually a pretty nice guy when he's not out doing dangerous stuff. Aaron Paul admired the young actress so much that he said he'd love to adopt her as his own daughter. When the actress was just 12 years old, she actually had the chance to visit Aaron and his wife, Lauren, in their home. The Hollywood couple was completely smitten by the young girl. To quote Paul, Millie may have been 12 in years, but her spirit and her mind were timeless. A wise woman was speaking from her cherubic face. Millie also likes to post on social media whenever she's hanging out with the two whom she calls her fake adopted parents. Who knew such a beautiful friendship could spring from a celeb to celeb chat for a magazine? Did you know that Millie Bobby Brown owns a production company? She's not just an amazing actress, she's also a budding media executive. She owns PZMA Productions, by which she is set to produce and star in a film series based on Nancy Springer's Enola Holmes Mysteries novel series. MBB is also set to take over in the same streaming platform that launched her career as Eleven. She's producing a Netflix show called A Time Lost, based on an original story written by Millie herself, along with her elder sister, Paige Brown. Before the current situation swept the world, Netflix also got rights to the Enola home series. There's really no stopping the girl from taking the world by storm. We won't be surprised if she rises up the ranks as a producer too, given her innate talent for writing and her good eye for production. Next up, did you also know that Millie Bobby Brown is a gym rat whose favorite workout is Muay Thai? Her schedule is quite full all the time, so Millie Bobby Brown is homeschooled. To keep her body in tip-top shape, she does Thai boxing on Mondays, Jiu-Jitsu on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and on Wednesdays, she does boxing with a world champion. Her little body and small physique may not reflect all the hard work she does, but don't be fooled. Millie is so committed to her workout routine that she actually has her own punching bag outside in her garden. She says she has to do all this work in order to remain fit since she loves eating a lot. She posts a lot of workout videos on her social media accounts, and it's inspiring young girls everywhere to be mindful about their bodies too. Did you know that Millie Bobby Brown once showed signs of being a flat earther? Up to this day, we have yet to get confirmation if she was being serious or sarcastic. But in one Instagram Live, she was asked by a fan whether she thought the Earth was flat and nobody could have anticipated her reaction. Her eyes lit up in excitement about how she was just watching a video of Shane Dawson, which led her to believe that the planet we're living in is actually flat. Millie even said there are a lot of reasons to believe so. We really don't know who's teaching the young actress science in her homeschool classes, but I honestly think her parents should get a refund. Then again, you'd be surprised how many celebrities and influencers believe all of those conspiracy theories. Another weird thing that not a lot of people know about Millie Bobby Brown is that she's scared of bungalows. I know, even she had a hard time explaining this to Jimmy Fallon who wanted to know what spooks the young girl. She said she feels uneasy about the houses that do not have stairs. Now before you judge her for being an arrogant or insensitive person about people who are not as rich as her, you've got to hear out her reason. For a kid, it actually makes a lot of sense. 
Millie says she's uncomfortable about houses that do not have staircases of any sort, because what if an intruder enters the house through the main door? At least when there's a staircase, you can probably run and hide in the second floor while you plot an escape route that does not involve the front floor. Next up, loyal fans of the young actress already know this, but if not, then you should know that Millie Bobby Brown is partially deaf. She was born with partial hearing loss in one ear, and this grew more and more serious as she aged. At one point, she completely lost hearing in one ear and the doctors could no longer recover it. If you think this doesn't affect Millie's daily life and career all that much, then you have to remember that acting is not her only passion. Millie Bobby Brown also loves to sing and has plans of being a singer. MBB does her best to remain positive. She says she's just singing because it's something she enjoys and not because she thinks there's a career to be had out of it. So she doesn't actually care if she sounds good. She just wants to have a good time. Next up, speaking of making a career out of her voice, Millie actually has done that before, but not by singing. If you played The Sims 4, you would recognize MBB's voice as the event coordinator of the Positivity Challenge. Brown became an ambassador for The Sims in 2018, and her personalized sim was uploaded to the game. She received wide praise for this gig. Apparently, her voice was perfect for the role. Next, did you know that Millie Bobby Brown can rap? Yep, a phenomenal actress who can do amazing voiceovers, who also loves to sing, who can also bust out a rap verse. I mean, what can't this girl do? We have to thank Jimmy Fallon for letting us know all about this. Once on The Tonight Show, Millie Bobby rapped a verse of Nicki Minaj's hit song, Monster. Everyone was shocked when she started dropping those lines as if those words meant something to her. It was awesome, but no one could have prepared us for her second appearance in the show, where she did a recap of Stranger Things Season 1 through another rap. It was an incredible performance and we were all blown away with how well she did. Next up, MBB is such an amazing actress, you would think she has some really impressive acting mentors. But unfortunately, for those who didn't like Twilight, Miss Isabella Swan is one of Millie's acting idols. Aside from Jodie Foster, who is basically everyone's acting idol, Millie lists Kristen Stewart as one of the people whose acting abilities she admires the most. She loved her in Twilight. She loved her in Panic Room. And this little girl wishes she could be on a new all-girl squad together with Kristen and Jodie. Despite her young age, Millie has the incredible ability to relate to her older colleagues. For example, she is very, very close to Winona Ryder despite the massive age gap. So now, speaking of older friends, Millie Bobby Brown has revealed that she's text mates with Ariana Grande and is practically BFFs with the Kardashians. Millie is a certified Arianator, and she loves going on Instagram to swoon over the pop star's latest hits. She even posted a short clip of herself lip syncing to Boyfriend. Ari sends her love back by posting pictures of her together with captions that show just how much they love and appreciate each other. Now, the mutual love between MBB and the Kardashian clan also has a lot of attention online, since both sides are extremely vocal about their love for each other. When MBB told Jimmy Fallon that she loved keeping up with the Kardashians, Kris Jenner tweeted a video of her interview saying she loves the little girl. Chloe and Kim promptly jumped onto the Twitter feed to also profess their love for the Stranger Things actress, and then one good Friday, Kim and Millie actually got to hang out together. Did you know that Millie was totally fine with shaving her head bald for the role of Eleven? This is when she was younger, but she also had to convince her mom to let her do it. It wasn't until the final audition that Millie learned she had to let go of the beautiful locks if she really wanted the role. She was hesitant at first, but then she gained the courage to agree when she was presented with a crazy picture of Natalie Portman wearing her head bald for a role. Even when she was convinced, her mother was reluctant to let her hair go for fear that it might limit her future prospects and projects. Eventually, and to everyone's benefit, she caved. Now, isn't that the best decision she's made in her life? Another strange fact is that Millie is completely in love with the 80s. To completely immerse herself in the imaginary place where The Stranger Things is set, Millie devoured everything 80s. Everything like comics, pop culture references, movies, and everything else you can think of until she totally fell in love with the era. But even before auditioning for the role of Eleven, she was already seeing movies like Stand By Me and E.T. So when she got the job, she was psyched about having the chance to make believe that she was part of that glorious era. Last but not least, did you know there are people who make a big deal about her friendship with Drake? It's no secret that the two artists are really close friends, but apparently not everyone thinks it's such a good idea for the two musicians to be hanging out that much because of the age difference. People took offense when Millie revealed that she and Drake text a lot, with him giving her advice about boys and relationships. I think it's a beautiful friendship, really, but some people think it's a tad inappropriate for a grown man to be talking to a young girl about these things. But hey, who said only older women can be role models for young girls? So there you have it. 
Some of the craziest and strangest things you never knew about Millie Bobby Brown. Are you a fan of MBB? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching the video.